Well, happy Thursday, Calvary family. Uh, I just wanted to give you a quick Thursday update as we have been in the habit of doing. Um, as you may have seen this week, uh, Governor Murphy has changed a few of the guidelines and restrictions. I'm sure uh, many of you are excited about the being able to do indoor dining at 25% capacity. But one of the other things that Governor Murphy changed on Monday uh, is the indoor capacity for uh, religious services such as church. Um, now our sanctuary was already uh, marked off for social distancing uh, and uh, we have been adhering to the no more than 100 individuals uh, in the sanctuary. Now, honestly, there's been a couple times we've just, we've passed it just a little bit. Um, but uh, Governor Murphy actually increased the uh, capacity to 150 people or 25% uh, whichever is smaller, and in our case, 150 people is smaller than the 25% capacity. And so uh, I know a lot of folks uh, that we, we've been having great Sunday morning attendance. We're going to still continue to have two services, 9 and 11, um, because one service would not accommodate uh, the social distancing needs and our entire church family. Um, but we have, uh, with those eased up on the restrictions up to 150, I hope what it does is give you some confidence that uh, things are improving. Uh, things are, are continuing to go in the right direction. And so we, uh, what we ask everyone to do when they come is to wear masks. Uh, if you would continue to wear your mask at your seat, if you can, that would be wonderful. Um, but we are asking, requiring everyone when you enter and exit to wear a mask. Uh, and if you're walking around the sanctuary, please make sure you're wearing a mask. Uh, we're, we're even doing it. I, I've got a mask in my pocket right now because uh, school's back in session for Calvary Academy and uh, we got we had students and what a, what a great blessing. Um, but we, we are required to wear masks. It's inconvenient and it's a pain, uh, but we're still doing it. Uh, and so uh, hopefully if you haven't had a chance to join us yet, uh, we'd love to have you come and be here a part of a Sunday service. And then another thing that I want to remind you of is that uh, September 13th, so next Sunday, uh, we will start our children's ministry back uh, at the 11 o'clock service. And so we're not going to be able to do infants and toddlers, but uh, pre-K and elementary will have their classes as normal, um, but it will only be for the 11 o'clock service. Now we do ask uh, when you come that you make sure your kids don't have a temperature, uh, that you make sure they haven't been sick, those kind of things. Uh, we have our regular seasonal allergies that are coming up, but uh, we will be doing temperature checks for children. Um, as they come and we'll have just a brief health questionnaire. Uh, just again, it is just making sure that we're doing our due diligence, uh, that people are, because uh, as you know, kids have the opportunity. Uh, <laughs> I was a children's pastor for many years. Kids are little germ carriers. And so we just want to make sure that everybody's healthy and whole uh, as we're doing it. But we're doing things safe, uh, distanced, and uh, as per the guidelines. And so uh, I would love to have you come join us. And just another reminder, uh, we started it this past Sunday. Uh, we'll do it again this Sunday. We have two large tents set up out in front of the sanctuary, not right in front of the doors. They're out uh, wider, so you don't, if you don't want to go under the tents, you don't have to. Um, but we're putting out there so that it can create some fellowship space where you can be out of the sun uh, and have an opportunity to talk and uh, be with each other. Uh, again, in a socially distanced manner, wearing your masks. But uh, the, the concerns about the COVID-19 are much, uh, much less and, and much they're, they're, they're greatly reduced in the outdoor environments. And so we just wanted to provide that as an opportunity uh, for you to be able to fellowship and meet together. Um, I'm excited about all the things that God's doing. I'm excited about the direction that we're going. Uh, I wanna encourage you, make sure to join us this Sunday. Um, and uh, I know it's a holiday weekend and a lot of, a lot of folks are kinda of getting their last hurrah in. Um, but I, I wanna tell you, whether you're in person or online, this Sunday's message, I think it's gonna be a powerful one. Uh, it, it's titled, Stuck in the Middle. And uh, I really would encourage you to make sure that you grab it and uh, watch it and be a part of that. And so, hey, uh, it's going to be a great time. And we're trusting God for great things. Uh, and we're excited to see you soon. Uh, I miss you all. I love you all. And uh, look forward to worshiping either online or in person with you this Sunday. God bless. Have a great day.